for field. Let me put that up here, acquaintance. And acquaintance, which is an intermediate level word, is similar to friend, but it's less familiar. So uh, let's see. Maybe you've just talked to that person a little bit, or you know that person's name and their face, but you're not really friends. And this is what an acquaintance is. Let's practice this word. Here's a simple sentence. Mary is friends with John. Let's make a yes, no question with that sentence. Is Mary, is she, is she friends? Is she friends with John? Now let's make a reported speech situation with this question. Is she friends with John? Mark asked her. Mark asked her. Mark asked her whether. Mark asked her whether she is. Uh, be, now the direct, the direct question is, is she friends with John? That's the question form. But when you're doing uh, reported speech, it's not a question anymore. So you can't use the question form. So is she friends becomes she is friends, back into a sentence, back into a statement. Mark asked her if she is friends with John. Also in reported speech, you do something called backshifting, which means uh, in this case, you take the present is and you change it to past. If she was friends with John. Mark asked her if she was friends with John. Mark, Mark asked her if she was friends with John. He asked her whether she was friends with John. Uh, let's, let's answer no. They're just familiar with each other. They just know each other's faces. They just know each other's names. They are just acquaintances. No, they are just acquaintances. Now let's change this into reported speech. She said. She said no. She said no. She said no, they were. They were just acquaintances. So in the direct speech, they are just acquaintances, but we have to change the present to the past and say they were just acquaintances. She said no, they were just acquaintances. Let's see, Fabian Perez says, good afternoon, nice to watch you again. Hugs for you and thanks. Thank you, Fabian, for watching. Okay, let's see. So they don't have a close relationship. They're, they're not friends, but they know their names. They know each other's names. Uh, they're familiar with each other. They're just acquaintances. Okay, let's try another situation using the word acquaintance. Lucy, here's a situation. Lucy got a job at an important company. She got a job at an important company. Listen to me say that in normal speech. She got a job at an, she got a job at an. She got, an, she got a job at an important company. She got a job at an important company. She got a job at an important company. Let's make a how question with that sentence. She got a job at an important company. How would you make a how get job question? How, how did she? How did she get a, listen to how that sounds in spoken English. How did she get a, how did she get a, how did she get a job? How did she get a job at an important company? How did she get a job at an important company? How did she get a job at an important company? How did she get a job at an important company? Let's make this a reported speech question. Mike asked her. Mike asked her. Now we have the direct question, how did she get a job? That's a direct question, but when you add Mike asked her, you don't have a question anymore. You have to make a statement. How she got a job. Mike asked her how she got a job. Mike asked her how she got a job at an important company. Now, because it's reported speech and got is in the past, we should change this 
to past perfect. How she had gotten, how she had gotten a job. Mike asked her, Mike asked her, he asked her, he asked her how she had gotten a job, how she'd gotten a job. He asked her how she'd gotten a job at an important company. He asked her how she'd gotten a job at an important company. Now this is what Lucy answered. She said, she has a friend at that company. She has a friend at that company. But let's change friend to acquaintance. And so this means they're not really close. Maybe they know each other. Maybe they met each other one time or two times. They know their names. They know the faces. But they're not really good friends. They, they don't talk on a daily basis. So she has an acquaintance. She has an acquaintance at that company. Uh, let's see. She said she has an acquaintance. She says she has an acquaintance at that company. But now we have to backshift. Now, has is in the present, so we have to change that to past. She had an acquaintance. She said she had an acquaintance. She said she had an acquaintance. She said she had an acquaintance at, an import, at, at, the, at that company. She said she had an acquaintance at that company. Okay, let's move on to the next vocabulary word.